back to a couple of games. I'm Ivy. And I'm Gabby. Um, for reference. I'm gonna do a stupid. Oh god, she's doing a duck. Um, I've played 40 minutes of this game, as you can see here already. That is my, my caveat for, for my experience with Prey. Um, we're gonna we're gonna jump into to three. We're gonna do just normal bullshit. Prey is supposed to be a scary game. Yeah. So um, I went and turned off all the lights. Yeah, I don't do good with scary games. Also, uh, uh, please take into account that tomorrow, as of recording this, and today, as of at release. seven p.m. as of release. Seven p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Seven p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We're going to be recording. Are uh, streaming live. Um, the surge. The surge. That's the plan for tomorrow. Yeah. Um, so be sure to catch us with that because we do like hearing from you guys. Yes. And chit chatting while we game and talking about the game. It worked really, really well with Dark Souls. Bloodborne. Not Dark Souls. Bloodborne the other week. Yeah, Bloodborne was really, really nice. You guys were really nice. So shout out to those of you who who caught us live then. Um, but yeah, we're gonna be playing uh, Prey. What is this game even about? Uh, I'm not gonna tell you that. I'm gonna let you experience the, this intro the same way I did. Oh god. With next to no information about the game. Okay, I'm gonna die. Yeah, you probably will. Actually, I think it, cause it's more atmospherically creepy than it is jump scary, which is something okay. I do really appreciate about it. Um, as Jump well. scares are always shitty because yeah. they make you piss your pants. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Can you imagine us playing SCP Containment Breach? No, I can't. We're not going to do that. <laughs> we're not We're not inducing that sort of hell on us. On you. Um, us. Next to our game, you get to play. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. Okay. So it's... It's, it's future -y. 14 years in the future. Yeah. All of this tacky stuff that's available to us right now, really. This is weird. I don't get entirely how it works, but... Hey, Morgan. Wake up. You're burning daylight. You sent the helicopter to pick you up. It's just a few tests. Don't forget to wear your suit. See you soon. Oh, Three listen. Uh... Really great you decided to come on board. We're gonna shake things up, Morgan. Like old times. Delivery. Huh. Okay, so you're Morgan you. Yeah. Um, where the hell is that neuromod? Um You can pause for that if you care. We don't right now. Okay. Here's the suit. Yeah. I kind of like this cutscene. And they do the shadow really well there, too. Obviously, you didn't put it all on because there's no way in hell you could have gotten dressed that quickly, but. Um, art. Oh, Alpha. Note. Um, part of the walk. Work, I think it was, dear. But nothing. Walk. There. I don't know what that does. Literally go back and look at it for a second. Give me a second. I want to get this stuff. Walk. Oh, yeah, part of the walk. I want us to get a walk at some point, too, by the way. Okay, video game. Don't care about reading stuff. Where's the... Yeah. Where's Is the that an old Sega controller? No, no, that's a... It looks like a Sega controller. Where's the thing? I don't know. Your, your mod. I don't know. It doesn't much matter. Morning, Miss You. Heard there's a chopper on the roof. Must be for you. Yeah, I do like the control scheming for this game. It's really, really good. Oh, jeez. Like the, the... That's a really great color. Yeah. Okay. So, for those of you who have seen play gameplay and or have played it themselves, I'm sure you can understand how interesting it is for me, having already gone through this, with somebody who has it next to me. Okay, it's very nice to It is. Ms. Yu, please make yourself comfortable and we'll be on our way. Transtar facility is just a short hop. 
70 <laughs> degrees. <laughs> Clear skies all the way. Something's gonna go wrong. <laughs> Something always does when you're in a helicopter. I mean, a luxury helicopter. Yeah, I know, right? I stepped into this the first time, I'm like, this is it's not like what I expected. Flag. I can't see anymore. No. Yeah. It looks very close to us. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to go this way. That's a nice view on the bay there. Ha! <laughs> I didn't catch the, the An company name. Studios. An Arcane Studio production. Guys, you made it. So, there's a thing you'll notice here. You get here, and it's like, wait, wait, why did they fucking send a goddamn chopper? Right? Yeah. Like, it's not that far. My building is somewhere over there ish. Why did they fucking send a chopper? That was my thought. I'm just. Alright, whatever. I am to transport for a high end person? I don't know. I mean, like today's our first day of the job. Glass on the way out. Good luck to you. Hello, Doctor Hughes. I am a civil four nine five science class operator. Welcome, Morgan. You you have a nine a.m. appointment in the testing facility. I am aware. Please, thank you. This reminds me so much of Soma. This... Uh, wait until you get to the point. Uh, like, at the beginning of the game, Soma. Yeah. You wake up, Morgan, you go to finally. a testing facility. Hey. Yeah. You don't look terrible in a Transtar uniform. How's your eye? Still red? I know the test might seem a little unconventional, but it's a you family tradition. Breaking convention is in our blood. Once you start the test, just do whatever comes natural. Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy's gonna walk you through the process. You're in good hands. So that's my cousin. We'll be in orbit next week. I promise. Mr. Yu, they're ready for your sister in room A. Right. That's your brother. Listen. Yeah. Just be yourself. I'll see you after. Door, walk into here. Yeah. Good morning, Morgan. I'm Dr. Bellamy. Uh, Looks like we have some tests to run through this. today. So Probably not the kind of thing you're used to, I imagine, but trust me, you're going to do fantastic. All good? Okay, Great. Just seems Let's kind of begin. Really fucked up. For this first test, I'd like you to remove the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. Just go with your gut. Okay? Wonderful. Press the red button when you're ready. Wonderful. That's... Uh, you're absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B, then. Uh, I think that must be my time. Okay, Morgan. Listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. Take your time, relax, think it over. No, I'm kidding. You only have nine seconds. Hit the red button when you're ready to start. Look, is she? She's hiding behind the chair. Hmm, uh, any synaptic register? At all? No? No, that's fine. Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. Head into room C. We're doing models. So I screwed that up last time when I did it. I hid over here mm -hmm. and crouched because I thought I was just supposed to like hide from everything. But no. That's what I'm supposed to do. Okay. All right. Here we go. For this test, Please press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can in the most natural, intuitive way possible, without thinking. Just, just go for it. 
Press the red button when you're ready. I'm sorry, can someone please explain to me what's happening? Simmons? I installed exactly what Tina brought down. Did you double check? Speaker's still on. I apologize, Morgan. We're having some trouble with the equipment. Not your fault. You're doing fabulous, actually. One last room. Let's step into D. The D. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Go away. No, nobody likes to stop it. Oh, what the hell? So it just kind of disappeared. I don't know what's going on. Yes, restart. That was interesting. <laughs> oh, okay. Can someone get me a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, Morgan. Have a seat at the table for me, please. Wonderful job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. I'm going to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Press start on the screen when you're ready. Start. You're planning a vacation, go somewhere familiar you know you love, or try something new. Familiar. Good. Looks like you've got the hang of it. Keep going. Okay. You've been sentenced to death for your actions. How does that make you feel? Calm. It was fucking worth it. Ooh, that's heavy stuff. Oh, Jesus. A runaway train is bearing down on five people who are tied to the track. You can cause the train to switch tracks, but there's one person tied to the second track. Switch it. Good. Next. A runaway train is bearing down on five people. You're standing on the platform next to an enormously fat man. Push him into the tracks and stop the train. Yeah. Push the fat man. Almost done. A runaway train is bearing down on five people tied to the track. You could stop the train by jumping onto the track, but you would die. Push the fat man. <laughs> you know what? I'd probably do the same thing. You never well said done. the fact it wasn't well still done. there. Exactly. We through it. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I want you to take a good look at it. In a moment, I'm going to ask you what... I don't know if you noticed uh, it. I don't think you did. It's empty. I was paying attention to this because I saw that happen. You can see his leg come up over and switch into the coffee mug before the guy picks it up. Alex. I'll show Alex. you in the, What's going on? this after we're done recording. We have a problem. What about Morgan? She's alive, sedated. Clean it up. I'm on my way. What the fuck, man? It gets Do you turn into better. Look at that? Good no. morning, Morgan. It Today gets is Monday, better. March 15th, 2032. Wasn't it the 15th when you started? Yep. What the fuck? You'll see. Do we just do the fucking... You will see. It didn't... It didn't. It didn't show the the symbol on your little clicky thing. It didn't, but it didn't it didn't call anybody. Nice part, idea. Yes. Now, if you notice. What the fuck? Eon. End of message. From January? Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't see that. What the fuck? Hello, Morgan. It's time we spoke. My code name is January. You're not dreaming. What happened yesterday was real. If you want to know what's going on, first, you need to get out of your apartment building. You're not safe. Are you ready to see, see the best part of this? So ready to see what I was trying to do? I started to open the door here. Yeah? 
That makes sense, right? Yeah. What? Good. You're in the simulation lab. Now get to the exit. I'll keep in contact. What the fuck? My cousin? Your cousin? Uh... Well, my brother, remember? Your... Okay, so your brother put you in a simulation. Yeah. We don't know why. Why? I know why. You don't know why. And he put you in a simulation. Over the same day. Of the same day where you're fucking... Ah, there we go. So remember how we, we had the stuff? We had to go from my floor. To the roof. Oh, of course we Ah, there we go. Notice those minor changes? Oh yeah, here's the helicopter. Oh, so it didn't actually go anywhere. Nope. This all changes on ya. So Everyone calls them mimics. Be careful what you pick up. Okay. That's weird. Yeah. So that's that. Him to do this. You asked him to. Yes. What? Um. Do you want me to just tell you? No. So they can't attack you. Yes, they can. Right like that, right? Uh, it doesn't look While like they're they running can. Away from you? Uh, oh yeah, no, they totally could have. He could have 100% attacked me right then and there if he'd wanted to. But he didn't. Nope. He was just startled, so he bolted. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> this is so strange. <laughs> it's really amusing because now I'm the less scared one. Ah, here we go. What? what the fuck? Does it just suck the life force out of you? Pretty much. Oh my god! <laughs> no one has been able to stop the mimics from multiplying since they broke containment. I'm going to help you stay alive. Just a little further. So anything you see time you see doubles of anything, you should be pretty pretty worried that uh, that, that might be a mimic. Oh my fucking god. <sighs> yeah. Or did. Uh, taking data related to mimicry and remote manipulation out of the research department. Get to the trauma center and grab the key card to his cabin off his body. Yeah. Yeah, isn't this great? Play your way. Okay. 
Yeah. So, is he dead? Bellany? Oh, yeah. Straight up. 100% fucking dead. You watched him die. Okay. So they can only mimic things. That's all we've seen so far, yeah. I'll send you the white paper Alex and Morgan wrote. Here's the nutshell version for now. Gaining a new skill from a neuromod works similar to the way your brain creates new memories. In fact, it's impossible to separate the changes the mod makes from normal memory formation. So if I want to strip the neuromod that makes you play piano by Gustav Leitner, I'll reset your brain back to the moment before you first installed it. They wanted Morgan's brain pristine to receive the prototype neuromods. That means going way the hell back. Hence the apartment sim. Yous are dedicated to their science, is all I can say. Oh, so you wanted to have this mod put in? These mods tested, yeah. Oh. And the only way to do that. Oh, ah. Fucker. Oh, Jesus. Ah. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you! <sighs> Oh, wow. so weird. Be a better weapon. <laughs> I can't go any further. What do you mean? Through the doors? Oh, I could have opened that door. I just sneaky, Didn't sneaky. Want to. Yeah. Because I can open this door because I have a key card. That's that thing. Uh -huh. That was a phantom. Typhon Anthrophantasmus. Keep moving. Uh, what the fuck? Uh, so this is the glue. Got the glue can. You can shoot glue. It disables and or immobilizes. <laughs> Stop. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's all glue. Oh, that's how you're supposed to do that. Hmm? Uh, yeah. Hi, Mimic. Oh, the stealthy bits to this game. Morgan, there. In the foyer. Grab the neuromod you see in the display case. Normally it's a fake, but I swapped in a real one for you. The neuromods are critical. You won't survive without using them to install new aptitudes. I've already updated your transcript with the list you requested. Take a look. Gross. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah, all right, so now we're getting back to the tense bits. Oh, jeez. Okay, so you're, you were supposed to... You were supposed to go through all of this... Yeah. ...in the simulation. Uh, no. Okay. Uh, I was supposed to get... Go through the simulation to reset my brain. Back to the point where I could accept Neuromod. Accept the prototype Neuromod, which are the cleanest slate possible. Except for, as you can tell, that went very, very well. Because somebody released the memory. Improvisation has always been your strength. You'd be dead if it wasn't. Now, but. Take you to the main lobby. Where is that? Just through here. So yeah, um, okay. there's not much more for me to explore in here right now until I level up some more. That's super fucking terrifying. Oh, hey, it gets better. Oh, great. You ready to see the lobby? Oh, God. Does my brother get killed? I don't know. I haven't found him yet. Oh, God. Keep in mind, I've only played 40 minutes. Like, this is gonna go so poorly. Oh, you're gonna love this part. This is gonna be your favorite part of all of it so far. I doubt it. Oh, I'm sure you'll love it. You uh, will be so, so happy. 
I am not sure. I am positive. Jesus Christ, Gabby. I'm not feeding you general tau chicken anymore. This is what it does to you. Oh no, I had wieners and beans over at Izzy's. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> you didn't tell me about that when I made you the food. No! Oh, was... what the fuck? Hi, Nash. Ready for your first <gasps> real view of the world? Oh yeah, you wanna see the, 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 the real world, dear? Okay. Oh my god, we're in space! Yeah, there's Earth. That's the moon. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome. To space. To Talos 1. Fuck off. Fuck off. No, fuck off. Give me that. Give me that. Careful. You need to get to your office. I've updated your map. My There's office. a video you need to see. I know you have a lot of questions. Uh, the only reason I'm not is because I've gone through some of this already. But yeah. Yeah, that. Remember how I told you this game does the atmospheric fear really fucking well? Oh, did she get killed by a mimic or did she get killed by another person? Who? The woman on the ground. I have no idea. Uh, we're gonna not deal with that. We're gonna not deal with that. Have a good day, Phantom. Have a fucking fabulous day. We're gonna go not that way. I have never dealt with a Phantom before. We're gonna go not that way. Uh, like that. Attention. Station leadership has issued an alert. All personnel should report to muster stations immediately and await further instructions. I don't think I did. Vital signs critical. Fuck you! What happened to the turret? Oh, I broke it. Fuck, I was hoping to use it. Come on, you can only pick it up and carry it. Well, I mean, I was hoping that it would do a thing. No, you picked it up before it could do the thing. I was hoping to reposition it, how about that? You threw it instead of putting it down. Yeah. Hi, Jason Chang. Um... There we go. I can't open that. Okay. Let's see how helpful you will be for me right now. Um, where am I gonna go? I'm gonna go up there. Let's put you. Oh jeez. Ah, oh, there's probably a mimic over here. There we go. Call that. One of the few advantages of, you know, understanding and studying game design is that you can kind of bullshit your way through things sometimes. There's another one though. Yeah, it's okay. I have the, the turret. turret got it. Yeah. Alright, you should head up. I'm going to, but I want to see... Can I fix this? No smoke. No, I can't. What can I do? I can't get in here. 
What the fuck is that? Is that the Talos one? Is that the yeah, ship we're on? I think so. 2030. 20, 20, 20, 20, Talos one becomes fully operational, representing a money. I don't like that. Can we not have sound? Can we not have loud things announcing exactly where I am? Thank you. Time to go upstairs. Uh, security seems like a much better place to check on. Ah. Okay, cool. You're not a, you're not a mimic. Go down there. Mmm, we'll see if my access card gets me. Nope. Ah. Not yet. Okay, cool. You really shouldn't be whacking everything. Says the woman who said that that's but exactly also, what she would do. But also, ah. That means that, that means one. Probably. I have to move it out of the way to take its place. Well, I mean, I didn't have to take its place, I just did. Staff lounge. Can't open that up yet, that room won't open up for me yet either. Uh, yeah, the, I am really happy for the most uh, thing, the PvP mode. It's a, a 1v5 asymmetrical. Five, um... Frickin' mimics against one human. Okay. Is this your office? No, this is somebody else's office. I'm in need of some more support. The volunteers are agitated more than usual this morning. Eleven threatened to bash my head in if I didn't let him out of to stretch his legs. When you got up here, the key code is 8148. Not the old number on file. I'm pretty sure they've been watching me punch that in, so I changed it. Cool. What room is he talking about? No idea. We'll figure it out. So, 8184? Ah, we'll see. I don't know. I'm just curious as hell fuck. Your office is 0451. Oh, that's where it went. So I did scare it off. I have no idea what it had been hiding as, though. No password found. Uh. Oh my god, this is weird. We might have to stop when you get to your office. Okay. You can't hit the power things too much. Yeah, uh. Key code change. Jason, mainster the keypad to my office. I have them set it to 0451. I'll be in the sims lab a while, so if you need anything, help yourself. Yeah, you put yourself in the simulation. That's from you. Okay. Zero. How much of this is mimic bullshit? Welcome back. This has been your home for the last three years. The video should be on your workstation. Yes, yes. Thank you. I want to figure out how much of this bullshit is fake. Bring one of the turrets in. I think this might be a, a safe room for you. Because it looks like all of the stuff in here is for you to use and shit. So I think unless I bring people in here. Paradox. Yeah. All right, let's see. What are my emails? He made it. Still don't know what happened. I put it behind me, but there's no reason you still can't be civil. You passed me in the hall today and you looked for, through me. If you're still angry, it's something I did. Tell me, we can talk about it. Pretend you can go to the nut and see me Help us to have to work together. Oop, I fucked with someone. You're in the office. Literally. I'm 
utilities. Watch me, Morgan. Day, right? If I'm talking to myself, it must be. Your memory shot full of holes, I know. I'm sorry, but it's permanent. So the first thing you need to know is you can trust January. It's an operator, a sort of backup of you and me. It knows what you've forgotten. Huh, cool. We've been testing a new kind of neuromod based on the Typhon organisms, mapping their neural patterns onto ours. The problem cool. is, when you uninstall a Neuromod, it resets your memory back yep. to the moment you first put it in. What you figured out? That's why you forget. There's supposed to be a process that brings you back up to speed between test runs. But someone could just skip that part. Turn a single day into your entire life. Well, that's exactly what Alex did. The question is, why? Oh. You're not going to like what I have to say next. down for them to pull the, the, the good old fire cry on us. Sorry, Morgan. Alex cut us off from the looking glass servers. Time to improvise. Isaac... Do you search Dr. Calvino's workshop in the hardware labs? He invented the looking glass technology. You might find a way to restore the server connections there. I'm looking for another way to help you in the meantime. Good luck. Cool. Ah. So you gotta get out of here. Looks like. We'll have to get to that place. But you gotta figure out how to get there. Yeah, uh, but we will do that. In next, the next time. Episode. We would play this, which will probably be on stream Holy later. Holy fuck, that's so fucking trippy. But as a quick reminder, catch us Monday, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to watch us stream whatever bullshit. This week is going to be The Surge. Next week will be probably more Surge, maybe some Prey, maybe some Wizards of Legend. I've been really enjoying that game lately. Who knows? Um, and... On the 27th of September, we will be doing a stupid challenge on stream, probably around 3 or 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Look for more information on that in the following streams videos. What day is the 27th? A Thursday? Yeah. So you're done at 2 because it's grading. We'll see. So until next time. Bye.